Today I want to react to a Revenant main that has mastered a Revenant's movement and it is a joy to see. Now the reason why I want to react to this player today is because Revenant's pick rate is going up a little bit. Now I have a feeling it's only going to remain for the ranked split in Kings Canyon where Revenant has always done quite well. But yeah, Revenant's getting a bit of a rise in pick rate. Now this is a great time to take a look at Revenant's full potential. So introducing Guapi, this player is absolutely crazy at Revenant. Uh, they've got 16k subs. I'd say go sub to them now if you want to see some unique characters that aren't just Wraiths or Pathfinder or Octane. You're going to be in for a surprise when you watch this. I haven't watched this video yet, but uh, yeah, it really is quite something special. So we're going to just jump into it and react to it on the fly. I've heard a lot of great things about this player. Right, straight off the bat, you see this... <laughs> Sorry, we're already pausing it, but look, this is like a... I don't know if you would call it Revenant's bread and butter because Revenant cannot wall jump. So these crazy Revenant mains have found a way to just uh, do other things, right? Like wall climbing around corners. I don't even know what's going on here, but look at this. It's crazy. And then you have the crazy crouch spam, of course. Revenant moves real fast uh, when crouching. There's a straight up death totem usage as well. I want to see that because... Uh, We've, you know, sorry, when, sometimes we spectate players in game with a bunch of kills on a legend and they just kill farm and they don't use their abilities, so it's really exciting to see already some oh, ultimate usage. Right there it is again. No one expects you to wall climb around a corner. It just is not oh, expected. He's low, he's low. Did you kill him? Oh my god. Oh, alright, alright, oh, oh, oh. here it is again. What, what would you call that? It's like almost a wall jump, but... Oh my god! She had no idea what to expect. <laughs> she just gave up. Just gave up. Uh, <laughs> you said the same thing. That's great. <laughs> That's a really good example of how it's used, because nobody expects you to come around the corner like that. Look at that. That's crazy. And you've got to remember, Revenant, he climbs faster as well, right? Just gave up. <laughs> Working out, apparently. Okay. I like this. A Ooh. bunch of cool clips. Nice little super glide. Nice. Going in with some Kraber action. Nice. I want to see how uh, this player's strafes are. You know? You can see it. It's always the crouch spam. Um, oh, nice shot there. Just destroying these guys. Another one. Here we go. Here we go. 115. Whoa! Oh, another shot, little super glide there as well. Okay. Reload and go for a clip. I love it. See ya, dude. Cracked him. Almost cracked him for you. <laughs> you get a clip? I think it. I think you just tried to do a super glide redirect there. That's nuts. What is going on there? Okay. This is what I was talking about the other day, right? Like I said, how. We've all seen Wraith mains in this building. Like, isn't it exciting to see something a little different? The way that he deals with this building is different. It's just like a new experience to watch. Yeah, Mr. Super Glide, yeah, that would have been cool if he hit that. Look at that! What is that? If you're a Revenant player, you know what's going on, but I don't really know, like, what, what is the mechanics behind that? Leave a comment, I'm really curious. Go subscribe to this, guys. Uh, I'll put a link in the description and also on the end screen, so keep an eye out. Ooh, the collat there, nice. What, sorry, hang on a minute. Was that something a little juicy? Take a look at this, right? Let's put in 0.5 times speed, I'm just really curious. So we go for the collat. Look at this movement. I don't know what kind of strafe that was, but in normal speed it looked pretty cool. It's a little bit of something. Almost kind of like a redirect. Oh, that one went to the moon. Love the way he's like implementing so many little mini crouch hops into everything. It's really quite interesting. The way he like navigates uh, terrain, like going from cover to cover is very much... He's taken every piece of... Ooh, that was a nice super glide. He's taken every piece of Revenant's movement, right? He's really going back and forth here, um, which really is quite amazing. With like just trying to use everything to its maximum potential. So the the crouch bonus speed for Revenant's passive, 
That's the first time that I've really seen a legend, uh, a player, really put it to some use on Revenant. A good use. Super glides coming in, left, right, and center. A really crack movement player, no doubt. That line. The uh, silence on the door. The super glide to wall run around the corner. That was neat. Okay. Wow. Look, what? That guy. Oh my god. That's so cool the way you. Like. What is that? Because Revenant can't wall bounce, like, traditionally, but it's sort of like a weird thing going on. I'd love for someone to explain that. What is... You see what I mean? Like, what is that he's doing? Like, the, the crouching, strafing... Just look at this. It's really interesting. He's, like, inputting a crouch every few little strafes. Uh, and the way your momentum is reacting to that is really quite unique. I don't know what it is. God, he's a beamer. He's a beamer as well. Look at that. Uh, definitely the flashiest Revenant player I've seen in my life. Ooh, okay. All right then. Goodbye. Do it. Do it. it oh. <laughs> I love it. That that little trick gets everybody. It gets everybody. Oh, nice shot. Oh, I have to try playing Revenant a little bit. I mean, I'll try and do this. I'll try and replicate it, but we know. It won't go very well. Pacing on this video is really great. I love the way it's just put together a bunch of sort of really sweet movement moments that really showcase Revenant's potential. Oh my god. So I wonder what makes him decide whether he wants to crouch or not. I, I wonder if there's any like decision making behind that. I'd be really curious to hear. Well. Okay, so before we get into the game, I just want to say thank you guys for all the support lately. It seriously means the world to me. We've been at this for so long, and it's it's just incredible to see it finally paying off. So I can't thank you guys enough. Uh, make sure you're following the Twitch. The link is in the description. That's where we get all of the content, and we're building... Follow the Twitch on screen there. right now, in the uh, link in the description as well. This is straight up gameplay now. We've got some clips. Going straight into the gameplay. I want to see more of this action in this building, for sure. All right. Oh, no, nine. Oh, he, he, oh. <gasps> who's thinking about it? All right, here we go. Oh, that was quick. Okay, that was neat. I guess you have a lot more control over how you uh, deal with this building because if you're, you can basically infinitely climb this whole thing in any direction. That's quite exciting. Oh my god, he almost just one clip, two people. His R9 aim is really incredible. Okay. I wonder how he, like, people who choose a movement, a, a character like Revenant is really interesting because he has some movement potential, but... He's got a high camera, and he's pretty big. I can't believe that Revenant used to have a low profile. He actually used to have low profile in the very, sort of, I don't know, maybe like the half, first half of Season 4? Before they realized that was a big mistake. He plays on stretch rest? Alright. See it? Oh my god, dude. He's really good with that. I just, I don't know how the mechanics work with how you do it, but he's really good. I can't imagine it's easy. I've got some climbing action. Oh yeah, these buildings as well are going to be amazing for Revenant. Yeah, 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 yeah. There it is. Look at that super glide. Okay. Dude, Revenant's got to be so fun on this map. But, yeah, you got to have a look. Like, come on, isn't this more interesting than just a typical Wraith gameplay? It's just chasing right right after them. That's crazy. Aw. You got to. <laughs> the chase. 
That was a very cool moment, not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. Once again, you gotta follow this guy. You gotta go subscribe to this guy. His content's incredible. He's really, really a unique player. Which is hard to say in the thousands of Apex creators. He did it again, that little crouch strafe redirect. I don't know what that is, but it's, it looks cool. I want to see what it's like to fight this guy. You know, from a third person perspective, what does it look like? It's got to be absolutely bewildering. Oh my god. Entire team, how's he going to deal with this situation? The armor swap comes in, he goes straight back in to back up his teammate. The beams of the R9. He really does, um... I wonder if there's, like, something there with the way that when you crouch, your your momentum and velocity work a little differently because of the Revenant passive. Is that what's going on there? The way, it looks really cool. Yo, that player was just absolutely flashbangs. <laughs> Could not see a thing. Nice. Alright. Oh, okay. Yo. It's a wild little battle in here. Really, he makes Revenant look like Wraith. You know the way Wraith's really low to the ground and everything looks faster with her and Lifeline and Watson? Maybe it's the stretched res or whatever setup he's running, but... It, you don't feel that feeling of that you're running a big, clunky, slow legend. Somehow. Even though the camera is definitely higher than the other legend. He's such a beamer. That was almost a really good super glide as well. It's really good at the... See what he did there? That was like... Oh, it's just a bit of a tap strafe, isn't it? It's really quite fascinating. Maybe what he's doing is tap strafing, like, whilst... And putting a crouch somewhere. The little crouch hop things he's doing. Really interesting. Okay, some totem action. Let's see it. I would love to see him with the old Revenant totem. It's been nerfed a lot. I really would have uh, loved to see it when there was... It lasted longer. The distance was, like, infinite. I think it's still infinite, but it doesn't last nearly as long now. Ooh, it is. Oh, it doesn't matter. I forgot. I'm like, oh, no, he's going to die. That was really good use of the uh, totem there. The whole concept's really cool as well. You literally get a free life, you know? Surely there's got to be a lot of, like, high-level play when it comes to how you use that, you know? In, in these sort of, like, crazy pub situations where you have, like, ten teams in the area. Oh, there's some crouch strafing. You know what's great about crouching? Is it actually reduces your hipfire more. So, the, um... The benefit is twofold when you're when you're crouching with Revenant, right? Crouch fire, hip fire. You're gonna have good aim. Uh, the purple lasers is gonna be even more insane. It's uh, just wild in here. Hard to see a thing. Yo, he's doing it again. It's like almost like a bunny hop. I don't know, dude. I don't know. A wild fight though. He look oh no, the third party crypto! Unbelievable, dude. They're fighting in there, though. Uh, he's, got, he's got gold. I think he can get out of this one. He's going to make it a juicy 4k, no doubt. Whoop! <laughs> he's stuck on her head. Yo, it's just what is going on in that building. It's absolutely nuts. Okay. It showed up again. What a battle. What a battle. Because you can't really see out of heat shield very well. This is a perfect example of how defensive legends can just slow down fights. The Watson fences in the, uh, I mean, classic traps. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Exactly what I'm thinking. You just said it's impossible to make a dent in a Watson team. It just is. <laughs> They're just gonna sit there until what the ring eats them, I guess. I don't know. He may as well just go. Oh, they <laughs> they Valk ulted. Unbelievable. I right, see so this is the late game. See what we got here. Yo. 
Yo. Oh, this is a nutty situation. Peace. Alright, goodbye, Wraith. One on the roof? Ah, oh, that is. That's unfortunate. Wow, he's got the 4K in the bag. Gotta, I feel like it could be fun to learn some of these uh, movement tricks he's doing. As Revenant, of course. Yo, that was a beam. It's the same Watson team as earlier. The fight continues. Jeez. Yeah, Bangalore without Watson. It really is. Oh my god. Oh no, no, no. Oh no, you got this, dude. You can do it. No. This is nuts. Run! Oh god! Oh god! This is incredibly close. He uses that. What is what is that for? To stop chases? I guess. I guess. Is that what he wanted to use it for? To stop the team chasing? Jeez! Oh my god! This is not. Oh the loba! The loba! Oh no! That's so unfortunate. Rip. Ah. Oh. All right. Go follow this guy. Go subscribe. All the details are in the description. This guy's incredible at the game. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you all in the comments. Cheerio.